we looked at some of our traffic counts and they were getting to the point where a two lane road wasn't going to cut it. This Sky 8 view shows the progress construction crews are making on Ashworth Road over I-80. It's part of a project that began last year to expand Ashworth to five lanes from Jordan Creek Parkway to Grand Prairie Parkway. But starting Monday, the bridge will be closed to all traffic, cutting off the north side from Jordan Creek and the closest routes to the on and off ramps for the interstate. In this neighborhood especially, it goes to Jordan Creek, which is kind of the, the big hub here in this area. So yeah, we use that quite a bit. Families like the Johnsons will instead have to detour north to University Avenue, then turn at Jordan Creek. It's a nice one. It's open, yeah, uh, and we're looking forward to it being open, but uh, mm -hmm. we'll, we'll adjust to make plans and it'll be fine. Right now, Ashworth is traveled by about 10 to 11,000 vehicles per day. Two lane roads typically only have a threshold for about 12,000. But new developments could inflate that number. The buildings on the corner of Ashworth and Jordan Creek were raised last week to make room for a Ruth's Chris Steakhouse and apartment buildings. That's why the city says it's better to expand the road now to prevent a traffic backup in the future. So when developments do come in, we can we can uh, ask them for that right away at the time of the development so that they're not building a building right where we need to put a road. In West Des Moines, Bo Bowman, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's news leader. The Ashworth Bridge over I-80 is expected to be closed until Memorial Day. The city of West Des Moines hopes to have the entire Ashworth construction project finished by the end of the year.